Get those food donations ready because tomorrow is our big scouting for food day. The past couple of weeks, we've seen folks collecting grocery items and donating those for families in need, but it really culminates this weekend. And there is a reason that we all need to dig deep and come through this year and make a difference. Sorting and shuffling. Preps underway ahead of a weekend of scouting for food. It means a lot to me to be able to come to a food pantry right now during this pandemic to be able to get food for me and my grandbabies. That was Loaves and Fishes client Veronica Bost telling us in 2021 why this decades long campaign to end hunger meant so much to her. But today the help might be even more important. The food pantry says community need for its services rose 38% since then with 106,000 people shopping at stores last year, 2023 could be just as tough. Rising housing prices with rising grocery prices. I just had to get the brakes repaired on my own vehicle. So anybody that experiences a financial issue like that and has to choose between getting the car fixed or putting food on their table, we're here so they don't have to choose between those things. And if you'd like to help, Saturday is go time. Drop off non-perishable food items at select sites around the Charlotte Metro. We'll be eager to greet you at some of the places like the Harris Teeter at Arboretum. And keep an eye out for those scouts. If you got a scouting for food door tag last week, they are coming to your home to collect as early as 9 a.m. Their support towards us, other scouts in the community putting towards effort in order to give back to their community. It's just what we're proud of here as Boy Scouts and part of the Order of the Arrow. Yeah, tomorrow's going to be a lot of fun for a very good cause. Of course, if you'd like to learn more, look for this Scouting for Food article. This is going to be in the featured section of our website. So right there, scroll down on the home page, WCNC.com. It's got all the drop-off spots around town and also the types of items loaves and fishes is looking for.